Welcome to Talking Pest Management. Yeah, pest management. <laughs> yeah we have yeah. Uh, no idea what we're talking about today. I have with me uh, Alex Maas of Megadeth Plagtebestreeding. Is that the right? Plagtebehirsing. Plagtebehirsing, yeah. okay. Yeah. That means we, controlling the pest. Exactly. It's not exterminating, but yeah. controlling. Yeah. Try to eliminate the problem without killing the animals yeah. and then monitoring that there's no occurring the next problem. And this is also yeah. the first topic, I think. Uh, yeah. Don't you agree that pest control, or in German, Schädlingsbekämpfung, mm -hmm. is so focused on control, it's not yeah. management. Because yeah. control means you have a problem, you need to deal with it. Exactly. But if you're managing it, or... Prevention is number one. Exactly. And That's I love one. that yeah. CMEX, by the way, yeah. granted pest prevention, yes. and one of the first, mm -hmm. right? Because IPM, you would probably yeah. agree, is yeah. all. Yeah, that's all. Yeah. And it doesn't solve your problem 100%, yeah. but when you do a good RPM system, good management around that, yeah. it will be it will solve 95% of your problem and the other 5% you can solve with uh, traps or yeah, yeah. other non -toxic stuff. Measurements. Yeah. So I've given people a quick yeah. round about what you do. So you have a service business? I have a service business. And you also create products, you have a lot of products that you design yourself. Yeah, and I have other a few of them I have a pattern. Mm -hmm. We produce them in China and then bring them here in Europe and nice. try to sell them. Nice. Yeah, yeah. and uh, my specialty is bird control. Yeah, you yeah, said I do that. a lot of bird control. And yeah. you're also very good at bed bug control, right? Yeah, we do a lot of, a lot of bed, bed bug control, mm -hmm. but um, it's not, not a business we really like because yeah. it takes two hours to clean yeah. a room. And even then, sometimes you have to come back because it yeah, didn't true, work out. True. Yeah. Yeah. On LinkedIn, I've seen that you post a lot of videos with a frost spray, green hero yes. frost spray. Yes, I really like also, the product. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thanks. it's a good product. And yeah. what do you think about it? I mean, we just talked about it earlier. So many people are really still enjoying to sell the bio side way and spraying. Um, why did you decide for your company that you don't spray any insecticides anymore against bed bugs? How much time you yeah. have left? <laughs> <laughs> Well, you know, when, when you put in biocides in the environment, then already there's a huge impact on the environment, not only for people, but also for insects and other products mm -hmm. and animals. Um, so when you can kill the product, uh, mm -hmm. when you can kill the insects mm -hmm. or the, the pests without mm -hmm. the biocide, it's always a better solution. Mm -hmm. Even uh, like mice, when you close the hole or yeah. Exactly. Just, the problem yeah, is done forever. Exactly, and you don't use any poison yeah. or trap or whatever, and you don't have to kill the animal. Mm. And that's why I like Green Hero Frost Spray. When you have to kill it, then you kill it in a very environmental yeah. friendly way. No resistance, also killing exactly. the eggs. Cool. Exactly. Yeah. Thanks, yeah. thanks for the compliments there. Yeah. One thing I really do want to share mm -hmm. with everybody who's watching mm -hmm. is um, you are also the chairman of your uh, Holland Association, right? Yes, so, Holland's organization. Yeah. yeah. So Holland is a country that I know everybody looks at. Everybody's looking at Holland because Holland, uh, mo next to Germany as well, and Sweden maybe, mm -hmm. um, uh, is one of the most innovative countries. Mm -hmm. um, I think rodenticides are banned pretty much outdoors in mm -hmm. Holland. Yeah. And also you're very front running when it comes to prevention. Yes. So how did the ban of rodenticides in outdoor areas change your business model and what is changing in Holland? Well, actually it changed our business model because we were forced to, it's a mandatory now. Mm -hmm. Outside you can only use a poison and rodenticides. When you have made a good uh, management system, habitat management, um, you put it in a uh, report for the client. The client has to do several steps mm -hmm. and then, uh, then you can after that, when you don't catch rats in your trap mm -hmm. and you have enough situations to explain that, okay, it doesn't work, mm -hmm. you only can use rodenticides for a period of 35 days. Mm -hmm. After the 35 days, you have to quit. Gotcha. And then you have to go back to traps again. Mm -hmm. So if you like it or not, it's mandatory. That's also yeah. what you said yeah. to some yeah. people in your sector. I yeah. really like what you said, yeah. maybe we can talk about that again. Mm -hmm. You said mm -hmm. the industry is going to change. Yes. And what did you say to your peers and colleagues? Well, the industry is going to change. And if you like it or not, you can be angry or not. You can scream, you can shout, you can cry like a little baby on the floor. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Yeah. It is. Everything is going to change and you can hop on the train and join it. And if you don't join it, mm. there will be only two solutions left. You quit your business or you have to sell your business. 
There's no other option then. Yeah. So you have to change if you like it or not. Mm -hmm. So selling the business, I think, yeah. is the better of the two options, uh, for yeah. sure. And as we just talked about, yeah. the sale prices in the uh, current market situation mm -hmm. with so many mergers and acquisitions by ready to see max service masks. But that's, the, but that's the current market. I that's think if you wait for five, six or seven years and you don't do any innovation mm -hmm. and you want to sell then, mm -hmm. I think the price will be much lower. Yeah, I agree with you. Yeah. And also for family-owned businesses, SMEs, mm -hmm. small mid-sized enterprises, mm -hmm. I think, mm -hmm. Um, they have a huge chance when the market is changing rapidly in the mm -hmm. next five to ten years. Yes. They have a huge chance of increasing their margin uh, um, way more again, the profit margin business um, exactly. than, um, for instance, all the big players could because they can't react that quickly. Exactly, and also the consumer demands more green yes. and lean and environmental friendly and animal friendly. So, true. So yeah. there will be a turning point in yeah. our business yeah. that your client forces you to do environmental friendly actions mm -hmm. without any poison mm -hmm. or sometimes without even using traps Yeah, I because agree. I don't want you to kill that mice. Yeah, yeah. yeah, Alex has a very interesting yeah. idea that's coming in next year yeah. which I'm not going to talk about because it's uh, confidential. It, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but it's really promising so yeah. everybody at LinkedIn you should follow Alex mm -hmm. in his journey. Mm -hmm. He's innovating. There are little people out there that are innovating and pouring mm -hmm. their own money, their private yeah. money into uh, changing the sector so this is really 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 cool um, one thing I also want to highlight here you are organizing an event right yes so can you tell us a little bit about the event and when it's coming where and who's coming well the event is from our brands organization when we do it every year we do one event yeah and this year it's about being proud of your job mm -hmm. uh, stolz of banner arbeit yeah. in deutsch <laughs> yeah uh, and we invited steve gold and matthew benton you mm -hmm. can also find them on linkedin very interesting people innovative yeah, also. guys yes. kudos to see you <laughs> on the 21st of november <laughs> so uh, if you like to join you you can sign up on the website of platform mm -hmm. uh, and uh, and you're welcome to come yeah yeah Super, and it's going to be people talking, like Steve Gold and Matthew Benton yeah. and all the speech. Yeah, and there will be a translator. So, oh, no, it's yeah, really simultan cool. uh, simultan yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, from English to Dutch and from Dutch to English. So, oh, nice. so when there is a Dutch speaker, yeah. Steve and Matthew will understand it. And when Steve and Matthew are talking, mm -hmm. the Dutch people can understand if they're not very proper in nice. English. Yeah. yeah. We're probably also going to be there. We're going to take yep. Mobit probably for filming, who's behind Good. the camera. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to have some fun on the event, driving to Holland yeah. and Good. getting some Dutch pommes, or what do you Good. call them, uh, French fries? <laughs> yeah, patat. Yeah, yeah, patat. patat. Really? Yeah, yeah patat. Right. Yeah. Interesting. That's yeah. the patatas. That's yeah. like Spanish. Yeah. Cool, so we're drifting off topic now a little bit. Uh, really enjoyed talking to you, cool. really enjoyed having you. Mm -hmm. We talked about many innovations, not only in the bed bug, bird control, mm -hmm. rodent control field. Mm -hmm. I think we have the same uh, c common opinion that A, pest control is changing a lot, uh, more than in the past 20, 30 exactly. years. Yeah. And that only, you know, it's survival of the fittest. Yeah. And I think there's a lot of companies out there mm -hmm. that are not on LinkedIn, that are not watching some YouTube videos, are not reading the magazines. There are even a lot of companies who don't even have a website, you know that? Yeah, I know, yeah. Yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> How is the market, yeah. by the way, looking in Holland? In, in Germany, we have like one and a half thousand companies, maybe one, 1,200. And mm -hmm. obviously, 1,000 of them, at least 80, 90% are one or two man bands. Yeah. Same in, in Holland? Yeah, there's, uh, it's not for sure, but they they make a guess. It's around 700 companies yeah. who do more or less in pest control. Sometimes it's a it's a, a garden company who also does wasps and moles. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it's a cleaning company. Uh, who also does spiders, mm -hmm. so it's not really a pest control company, but it's a side effect. And there, there are around 700 companies who mm -hmm. do that, but it's not for sure. There's not a real angle okay, to find yeah, out how much company it is. Yeah. So but always one or two people. Yeah, a lot of you see. Yeah, and then you have like yeah. five to ten big players or mid-sized players. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Same in Holland. Yeah. So last question, yeah. what, is, what are you doing in private time? What is, what is Alex Maas' private guy? <laughs> I know you have a family and you travel a lot, right? Well, you know, we have uh, one problem at home. I'm a workaholic, but my wife is also a, wor a workaholic. Yeah. So we work a lot, wow. uh, but uh, I have one hobby and that's scuba diving. Serious? Yeah, and nice. that's actually uh, the only hobby I have. And where yeah. do you go? Bonera. Bonera, oh nice. That's Caribbean. Egypt? Yeah, I really like Egypt it. Egypt should be great, right? Mm, yeah, depends where you go. Yeah. Yeah. 
Wow, yeah. nice. Yeah. Do you also uh, uh, um, uh, go through caves and stuff like that? Some dangerous uh, well, stuff? No, that's a specialty and it's better to do the specialty first before you go into caves mm. because uh, you have to have knowledge and yeah. safety precautions it's for that. It's super dangerous, isn't it? Yeah, but you can uh, visit wrecks and watch the fishes and, nice. and the turtles. Yeah, Sounds great. Really I never nice. did that. Yeah. Probably something I should look into as well. It's really nice to do. It's a completely different world. I yeah. believe you. Yeah. Cool. Okay. Thank you, Alex. Great to see you next time. <laughs> you too. Moments, thank you for filming. LinkedIn, hope you enjoyed it. Um, come over to Germany and visit us. Uh, we're glad to have you guys here. Uh, I think we're okay hosts. <laughs> so come over and talk to us. I would love to get to know you, all of you. Take okay. care. Bye. Bye-bye.